y'all need to stop raging. I gotta tell you guys that because so many people out here are taking themselves way too seriously on the streets, man. And the road rage from bikers over to other motorists, it's gotta stop. Stop the violence, stop the violence. I mean, real talk, a lot of these bikers out here, they do have legit reason to be upset when they catch people, when they catch motorists on their cell phones in traffic. They got a reasonable reason to be upset. But the problem is when you start taking the law into your own hands and you start getting physical, getting violent with people, putting, you know, yelling stuff at them, you know, ah, you this, you that, and flipping them off and all that kind of stuff. Not a good idea. Seriously, because that person could easily just, with a little turn of the steering wheel, just end up running you over. Not only that, it gives bikers a bad name. Bikers are now known to be these hooligans, these thugs, this posse of people that obviously just don't get along with motorists. I'm pretty sure there's a bunch of people out there that feel that way about motorcyclists. Motorcycling just doesn't come with, you know, the thought of riding a motorcycle. It comes with an attitude like, oh, you know, you're a biker. Oh, I'm better than motorcyclists. Oh, you know, you're cager, cager, cager. You know, you know, watch out for that cager. It's not like that. It really isn't like that. And it's unfortunate that motorcyclists get this kind of treatment because not all motorcyclists are like that. Not all motorcyclists are angry and the, <laughs> not all motorcyclists are angry at the world and want to lash out at every car that comes across them or wants to kick every door or wants to punch every mirror they come across. We're not all like that. We don't have death wishes or anything either. So real talk, guys, motorcyclists, brothers, Let's be a little bit more peaceable. Woo! That front end up, baby. Let's be a little bit more peaceable, you know what I'm saying? I mean, if somebody cuts you off in traffic, let it go. You're on a vehicle that's much faster and much more maneuverable. Don't position yourself, don't put yourself in a position to get run over, I'll put it that way. Because that's all that's gonna happen if you decide to let your anger get the better of you. Don't do it. Again, there's so many videos of people, you know, getting upset at what somebody did to them, you know, getting somebody getting cut off. Just a regular other motorist from, a, you know, for, from another car driver to another car driver. Some get bent out of shape and they want to start shooting each other and whatnot. Again, it's just like, why? <laughs> why even let it get to that point? As a person who's got the maneuverability to go around and weave in traffic, there's no need for me to stay next to another car, cuss them out, and try to get them to understand, you almost ran me over, what's wrong with you? They probably almost did run you over, and shoot, with the way some people are, they're crazy. They'll just say, oh, okay, I won't make the same mistake again, and go bop, and just run you over. So, yeah. Don't think that you're uh, invincible on these streets. That's all I'm pretty much trying to say. A lot of guys get motor, get on a motorcycle and they think they're invincible because they can do things in traffic that cars can't do. Don't forget, there are also things that cars can do that motorcycles can't. So guys, be careful on these streets. Don't let your anger get the better of you. That's pretty much the point of this vlog is to make sure that if somebody does something to upset you on the streets, which is gonna happen, it's not a question of if, it's just a question of when. When somebody does something that's gonna upset you, think twice about how you're gonna react. Just think twice. You're not gonna be able to show everybody, hey, look, I'm a motorcyclist, you need to see me. It's not gonna happen all the time. Not saying don't get upset. Definitely not saying don't get upset. You got every right to be upset if somebody did you wrong. But you can control whether or not if you're gonna go off on that person and call them out their name and this, that, and the other. That's all up to you at that point. 
So that's pretty much it, guys. I just want to let you guys know that because there's a lot of people out here that are getting shot, that are getting run over motorcyclists that, you know, who want to show that one car driver a piece of their mind. You know, they end up in the hospital. They end up getting run over. They or may even end up dead because they picked a fight with the wrong person who literally wasn't trying to have no more of it that day. They was, you know, that last nerve had already been tap danced on and that person just pushed them over the edge. So don't be that person. Let that stuff go. If somebody does you wrong, don't return it back to them. Just move on with the rest of your life. That's all I can really say. That's what I do anyway. That's my piece, 602 out.